Hi everybody, Bill Angelos here making another video. This one is how you can set up an email filter in Gmail. I don't get too much spam anymore uh, because I've built quite a few spam filters just to combat that. Um, but I've got one just a little bit ago and I'm going to show you exactly how you can build a spam filter so that you'll never get a spam from them again. So this one here is the, the one that we're talking about. And it's clearly from a marketer uh, because marketing people generally have email where it's formatted in this type of format where it won't go the full page length. It'll just be broken up. They do that because it's easier to read. You can read it faster. And they somehow think that it's going to get you to convert more often. And maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. Um, but I have no desire to check out what they're selling because I, I frankly don't care. The majority of it's crap. But what you do is you just go down to the bottom of the email, you find their, their address, and you just copy it. So we're going to go with that. We're going to hit copy. At the top of the screen, we're going to paste it in there. Hit the drop down arrow here. And you want to make sure that what you've, what you've put in there is in the area where it says has the words create a filter with the search and now what I do is I put never mark as important never send it to spam delete it now by doing it this way we don't ever send it to spam which means it never even gets in my spam folder it just gets put in my trash folder and and cleaned out it never gets marked as important it just it's gone okay and then now to apply it to the one conversation the one email that we were looking at and it's gone and we'll never get an email from them again and the way this works is it works based on their address so as long as you're not getting um, people using really generic stuff you'll be fine uh, somebody with an address like that it's you're never gonna get an email that's a false positive you're never gonna accidentally get something sent to trash that you really wanted because you're only doing it with addresses and for the most part addresses are going to be fairly unique you're not going to find a lot of people sharing the same address in different cities or even in the same state so hope you find this helpful uh, if you do this just a couple times you can really cut down on the number of crap emails you get sent in and really quick to look at uh, the spam that I have been getting well there's no spam here uh, it, it's it gone to my trash folder because that's where it all goes and you can see it's the same stuff here over and over and over and over the same people different names but they've all got one thing in common and that's the address that they have in their emails so as long as they keep using that address in their footer their email is going to go right into my trash and I'm never going to see it so thanks for watching